Hi guys, welcome back to Val's Kitchen where you find all the nice Jamaican recipes. You know Jamaica, you know Jamaica always not everything. We always put our twist on every little thing and get it all perfect. Thank you guys for watching my pillow video. It was awesome. Trinidadian dish. On today's menu, I'm gonna do some garlic mashed potato. So these are all the ingredients. These are my potatoes, some garlic, Here's the milk. I'm using cow's milk 100%. Here's the butter. I have salt, black pepper. I'm gonna peel the potatoes and put it together. All right. So guys, here are the garlic. I'm gonna put this together, the garlic, milk, and the butter. You want it nice, you know, nice garlic flavor. Oh, two pounds of potato, you know, two pounds of potato and about six pegs of garlic. You don't want the garlic overpower the potato, you know, you just want it even. Yeah. I'm going to put in the salt now, guys. I'm going to use about half tablespoon, right? I want you after the potato after taste you can fresh and you get the right flavor you have to have the right amount of salt all right so just cover about this and don't cut the potatoes too small because they will mash you don't want to mash all right when you're cooking a mashed potato you don't want the potatoes overcook all right so you have to cook at a temperature where you can get a nice creamy mashed potato After about eight minutes, it's about eight minutes now, right? So see it, the father, right? And I'm not, I'm not mushy, right? So we can just turn out the stove now. So here I'm gonna pour the milk, some milk. I don't want too much milk, you know, because it's a small amount of potato. Let's less than a cup. Yeah, what a cup. The milk now. I'm eating the milk. Yes. So there it is, guys. The garlic with the milk. We just want the flavor from the garlic, right? To combine with the potato to give it that garlic flavor. All right. Yes. So I get all the flavor, the right amount of flavor from the garlic. So what I'm gonna be doing? I'm just gonna add. In some butter, melt the butter. Want a generous amount of butter. Want a nice garlic flavor mashed potato. Now the next step, I'm gonna get this together with the potato. Right. What we do now is just pour the milk. Strain the, the, the garlic. Alright. 
get the garlic flavor that is what we want the flavor okay guys you know what i did i just use my judgment for the amount of butter and the amount of milk but if you're doing a mashed potato you don't don't use all of the liquid at once right don't put all the liquid at once you put it small small amount I'm giving an idea with the strainer, but if you have a hand mixer, you can use it, but the strainer does wonders. You don't want the lumps, you don't want the lumps in a in in mashed potato. So the strainer now, they help me to get it smooth. Smooth and fluffy, because I don't want to put it in the mixer. I don't want to use it to mix it, the hand mixer and mix it. Wow, it's yeah. yeah. Nice. So let me just finish this and come back. I'm showing. Nice. Hey, yeah. Fluffy. Nice. So what I'm gonna do now? Just get some black pepper. Sprinkle some generous, generous amount of black pepper. Right. Wow. Wow. Perfect. <laughs> oh my god, so nice. Guys, if I could call, just taste it. Just try this method. Try this and then tell me how it come out here, guys. a little of the melted butter with the garlic and the milk right and guys thanks again for watching right please remember to subscribe to the channel give me a thumbs up turn on the post notification bell as you never miss an upload thanks again guys and bye